It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Caps Brewers in the Netherlands and it's a bottle of their Caps Harry Saison coming in at 6.1% ABV. 330 milliliter bottle. There's the bottle cap. Without further ado, let's get this beer out into a glass, see what we get. Nice bit of smoke on the bottle opening. Beer in the glass then. I do like a Saison. Give it a whirl, get a bit of that yeast into the glass. A lot of the flavour from the Saison actually comes from the yeast, so it's very important you, you give that a bit of a whirl, that bottle, dump it in to the beer. You don't have to, I like to. One finger, white head, hazy, amber coloured beer, good levels of carbonation. Let's get the aroma. Oh, it's got like a, a peppery kind of almost spearminty aroma. Nettily, stinging nettles, like traditional German or Czech hops or maybe British hops. Brambling cross or something like that. I very much doubt it, mind. It's from the Netherlands, so. It smells good. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Oh, it's lovely. Really nice. Just very refreshing. I had a day of shopping today with the wife. We went to Cardiff. Um, town centre, half term, school holidays type of thing, feeding the kids, buying kids clothes. It's nice to come home, press the reset button and enjoy something that's, it's quite, it's very tasty. There's a level of sweetness in the beer from the malt a lovely kind of light Jacob's Cracker like malty taste coming through. A little bit herbal on the back end, herbal, spicy, farmyardy, horse blankety. Touch of lemon. It's really good. Really, really good example of a beer. Really tasty. Yeah, I I'm touching on the subject earlier about pressing the reset button. It's part of one of the reasons why I drink beer, why I review beer, why I enjoy beer so much is that I just find with a beer you can draw the line in the sand in your day. You can... The best way I think I've explained it already is just to press the reset button, just to, just to relax and have a beer. Nicely drinkable, very refreshing, but a little stickiness coming from the hops and obviously at 6.1% ABV there's a little bit of malt in there as well. So it's a little bit kind of malty and sticky and lovely. Really nice beer. Caps Harry. Ingredients, water, pills, uh, crystal, so pills, malt, crystal malt, wheat malt, uh, premiant, uh, sars, bitter hops, juniper berries, juniper berries. That's that kind of herbal flavour I was looking at. Juniper berries, that's what it is. Uh, Szechuan? Szechuan peppers? Wow, yeah, it is. I mentioned spicy and peppery earlier on. That's really interesting. I eat Szechuan chicken from the Chinese. Love it. Never had it in a beer before. Uh, Timber peppers, mustard seed. Wow. And a top fermenting yeast. It's a really interesting brew. I never look at the labels before beer reviews. I always go in blind. I always go in uh, so I get a surprise, like like you get a surprise when you read the the label on the beer or, or you start tasting the beer and you get lots of different flavours and aromas. Yeah, it is quite spicy and peppery. 
it's a, it's a very nice saison. They've done a great job on on spicing this one up. But it's not a burn. It's not a burn, spicy, peppery type of burn. It's pretty good. I'm going to rate it. Caps Brewers. I like this brewery. They, 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 they do some really interesting stuff. They're from Rotterdam in the Netherlands. Let's rate it. I like this beer enough. I really like that season. I'm really impressed with that. I like that enough to give it a Stone the Crows 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! Cheers.